There are so many wonderful resources out there to help us in our prayer journeys. And one of the things I have found very helpful in my later years in resourcing my prayer journey has been the liturgy of the Orthodox Church. I haven't had a great deal of uh, experience in being able to attend Orthodox services, although there was a wonderful occasion when the Orthodox Church in Swansea uh, put on during Lent Orthodox Evensong that they invited parishioners to in the church in Swansea. Uh, the, they used to hold Evensong in um, the town centre Anglican Church in Swansea and they put it on and invited all comers and it was wonderful. Uh, they put on Orthodox Evensong and we were invited and then they had a cup of tea for us afterwards. Uh, it was a wonderful experience and it encouraged me then uh, to use Orthodox even song in my private prayer uh, at home. Um, and it was a wonderful, wonderful experience. Uh, it, it was, there was a commonalities, uh, but different. So you could see our common Christian tradition, but through an entirely different lens, a, a tradition that had split so early on, you could see that it was almost unrecognizable. But because it was the same route, you could see that it was the same. Um, and their take on something different uh, gave one a fresh impetus. So I'd like to read you uh, some of the prayers um, that refreshed me. So sometimes uh, in order to be refreshed, we need to use a different take on the same thing. Their opening prayer to Orthodox Vespers, they call it, not even song. O heavenly King, O comforter, O spirit of truth, who art everywhere present, and fillest all things, treasury of all good things and giver of life. Come and dwell in us and cleanse us of every stain and save our souls, O good one. O holy God, holy mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. O holy God, holy mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, blot out our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities, for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and forever, and to the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one.